Hi, Libras. So thank you guys for tuning into my channel. Please keep in mind that my readings are general and may or may not resonate, so take with us and leave the rest. Also, please be sure to check your sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign for more insight. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys would like to book a $25 reading with me or just ask me a $10 question and answer, please feel free to do so by checking the email, I mean, the comment section below. All my email information is there. Okay, let's see what's going on with my Libras. Happy birthday, you guys. Let's see. We have finances and career. Financial issues are affecting your love life right now. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. And honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Playfulness. It says recapture romance by allowing your inner youthful spirit time to shine. Okay. So, I feel like there's... Let's see. I feel like there's somebody here that you are enjoying time with. It might be somebody new with this flirt and this playfulness. I feel like it's a very lighthearted energy, but it's very serious. But I do feel like with finances and career, there's something going on that doesn't permit this, this situation to go on all the time. It's a factor. There's some uh, mind games and manipulation going on here with this reconciliation that you might have called on. Yeah, I feel like there's some player energy here that somebody is trying to heal from. They feel stuck, but this person still wants this relationship with you, or you still want this relationship with them. Okay. Spirit, tell me more. Tell me more about what's going on with my Libra gang. Yeah, I feel like there was a reconciliation with someone from your past you decided to take this leap of new faith with. Yeah, with the judgment card, you took them back. And there's another tower moment coming. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I feel like this person intuitively knows that you're cheating. Or somebody knows that somebody is cheating here, okay? It's like, and they don't understand why because the relationship is like so stable. Yeah, I feel like it's you who is like, what the fuck is going on? You're guarded though. You're guarded about making a decision on who you're going to choose. I feel like it's over between you and somebody that you keep going back to, though. But spiritually, God has already stamped it as quick. It's done. Stamped, delivered. If it's not God, Allah, whoever you believe in, but spirits, whatever. It's all it's run full cycle for you guys. But someone here is not letting it go. Okay, spirit. Please give me the outcome. What is the outcome for Libra? What is the outcome for Libra? Seven of Swords. Yeah, somebody's still going to be sneaking off to be happy with somebody else. And it's going to make them sad. Somebody's going to be sad as fuck. The advice is to go towards new love and stop with this head and stop letting this <clears throat> stop letting someone control you and play mind games with you. Okay, I feel like either you're juggling somebody or somebody is juggling you, and that's what's causing the confusion here. Okay, so as you know, every Friday I do my questions. Feel free to think of some questions, meditate on them while I shuffle. And I will answer them for you. You will get three answers. They could all three be yours, or one of them could be yours. Take it as it comes. First answer is, a year from now, be assertive. And no need to worry, okay? No is at the bottom of the deck as well. Let's get one card from Rebel. Spirit, please give me one card. One card from Rebel from my uh, Libra gang. One card, please. It says, it's not everyone else's fault, it's yours. You are a grown-ass adult. Stop blaming others for your shit. So if you took this person back and this person fucks up again, you don't have nobody to blame but yourself, Libra, okay? That's basically what Spirit said. Spirit wanted me to personally tell you that, so it's a fact. Thank you, guys.